Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. If you're trying to remove your payment method on your iPhone but keep getting an error saying you have an active subscription, don't worry, you're not alone. This is a common issue, but I'll walk you through the exact steps to fix it quickly and easily. Just follow along and by the end of this video, you'll be able to remove your payment method without any issues. First, open the settings app, then tap on your Apple ID at the top of the screen, and then select subscriptions. This will show you a list of all your active and expired subscriptions. If you see any active subscriptions for apps like Snapchat, Tinder, Netflix, or any other service, You'll need to cancel them first before you can remove your payment method. To cancel a subscription, tap on it and select Cancel Subscription. Keep in mind that your subscription may remain active until the next billing cycle ends. If you're still unable to remove your payment method, move on to the next step. Even after canceling app subscriptions, there's one critical reason why you might still be unable to remove your payment method. It's none other than your iCloud storage plan. If you're paying for additional iCloud storage, Apple won't let you remove your payment method until you downgrade to the free 5GB plan. Is to check this, open settings, and tap on your Apple ID, then navigate to iCloud. And check if you have any active storage plan. If there is an active storage plan, change storage plan and then select the free plan. If you're using more storage than the free plan allows, you'll need to delete some files, backups, or photos to free up space before you can downgrade. Once your iCloud storage plan is downgraded, you should be able to remove your payment method without any issues. Now you've canceled all active subscriptions and downgraded iCloud storage. It's time to remove your payment method. So open settings, then tap on your Apple ID, navigate to payment and delivery, Tap on your payment method and select remove payment method. If everything is done correctly, you should now be able to remove it without seeing any errors. If your goal was simply to update or change your credit or debit card details, you can now add a new payment method without any issues right from here. And that's it. If you followed these steps, you should now be able to remove your payment method from your iPhone without any problems. Remember the key steps are canceling all active subscriptions and downgrading iCloud storage. Those are the most common reasons why people can't remove their payment method. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on more tips and tricks. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.